Hello my friends, this is Joe Garza with Ontario Bushcraft. Today I want to show off a, um, a fire and steel kit that a good friend of mine sent me. His name is Douglas Carlson. Here's the striker. Pieces of flint in here. Some twine. Pieces of blue gin material and some uh, in there there's some pieces of chart cloth. Right in there. As soon as I got it, I managed to make a fire. I was indoors, so instead of using grass, I used a piece of tissue paper and dropped the coal in there and, and blew it into a flame. Um, there's a story to this kit that, that Douglas made. The, the files were, were gathered by a boy scout that passed away. So there's some very uh, spiritual meaning to this particular kit. I, I'm very proud to, to have it. Uh, thank you, Douglas. Now I was inspired to make, uh, to make one from a vial. And here, here it is the broken file. I added some notches here to tie it to a rope. It could also double as a spear since I added a point here and I sharpened the tip. So it also has cutting, cutting abilities. It makes good little sparks. Um, I found some rocks outside and I broke them and they produce sparks so I managed to light some some uh, um, char cloth also with this kit right here that I made I've been experimenting since yesterday and all day making sparks and making sparks and making sparks I don't want to run out of uh, um, char cloth so, next I'm going to be making some, some chart cloth also, and just keep practicing with this uh, fire steel kit that uh, Douglas sent me. I'm very happy to, to, to have it. Thank you, Douglas. Thank you again. So, uh, here's the one I made. It doubles, like I said, as a knife. Small cutting edge here. And the notches to tie it to a stick and make a spear. So, it has several uses. I'm going to be adding that also to a little leather pouch. Well, thank you very much for watching Montero Bushcraft with Joe Garson.